The 3.0 update just launched and there are so many new features to play with. In this video, I will show you 100 things that you need to know to master these new elements. Huge shout out to Bedrock Armor for doing extensive testing for this list. Let's get started. Bombs ignite when you pick them up with Super Mario Bros. 2 Mushroom. Enemies that throw projectiles, like the Rocky Wrench and Spike, do not continue throwing them when picked up. Wigglers are bounced off of but can't be picked up. You still jump off of Bowser Jr. and Boom Boom and all the Koopalings. Standing on a Lakitu makes it go right forever until you get hurt. You can pick up and throw Bonsai Bills. Picking up and throwing a cannonball just throws it away instead of continuing its path. You can pick up and throw a snowball from any ground tile anywhere in the snow theme. Picking up a snow pokey turns it into a snowball. A chain chomp on a stump that's picked up will attack other chain chomps. Bowser takes 3 damage from chain chomp attacks and 6 damage for a big chain chomp. In the ground knight theme, the mushroom jumps at the same time that you do, but otherwise acts the same. You can't pick up other players or stand on top of them, even if both have this mushroom. Hold down then jump when flashing to do a 6 block high jump. You can pull the Lakitu out of its cloud. With the frog suit, Mario hops along the ground instead of just running. Holding Y makes you go faster underwater. In order to run on water, you need to hold something and get P-Speed first. With the P-Balloon, hold jump to go much faster. You float in place when not pressing any buttons. You can activate blocks from any direction by bumping into them. Hidden blocks can only be activated from underneath. Underwater physics doesn't have any effect on the movement. If you collect this power-up while riding Yoshi, you'll be forced to dismount. The spin jump height is double what it normally is with this suit. You can't glide while riding Yoshi. You can cling to a wall for about two seconds before sliding down it like normal. You can cling to the side of a wall of conveyors and go up or down depending on the direction of those conveyor belts. With the boomerang flower, the boomerang only deals one damage to bosses. You can't jump off of the boomerang that you throw. The boomerang will go down to meet Mario if it needs to, but it can't go upward after it's thrown. The boomerang can activate blocks and items, but not hidden blocks. The boomerang treats sideways springs as a normal wall. When wearing any of the new 3D World headgear power-ups, you can't activate other power-ups at the same time. You can still wall jump while wearing these power-ups. When the cannon box is equipped, the cannonball travels 7 blocks. The cannonball travels 11 blocks when charged up. The cannonball can trigger switches and break blocks. All cannonballs deal 3 damage regardless of charge. Cannonballs can extend exclamation blocks to the full length even when not charged. Cannonballs go through other players. The propeller box can't be used underwater. Dots on the side of the propeller box show you how many charges you have left. The propeller propels you up 6 blocks each use. You can press down to spin downward with the propeller box. You can't do a twirl jump or long jump with this equipped. A thwomp will still crush you from above with the red pal box equipped. The letters dim out as you use the charges. Acts identical to a normal red pal in the 3D world style. Ground pounding another player who has this will not activate the pal. While wearing the Goomba mask, Meowser randomly hops forward and backwards but doesn't attack. Boom Boom does not aggro against you even if you jump on him. Piranha Creepers don't extend or retract while the mask is equipped. Lava Bubbles jump to about half the normal height with the mask on. Charavar will peek up fairly often but won't arc across the screen. Icicles do not fall when the mask is on. Launchers don't launch anything while wearing the mask. Bonsai Bills will still fire. Bullseye Bonsais won't hone in on your location. Cheep Cheeps and Skip Squeaks do not jump while wearing the mask. With the Bullet Bill mask, you can fly for 54 blocks continuously before the bullet sputters and stalls out. Refresh the blast charge by landing on the ground again. Touching a twister also counts to regenerate the charge. Collecting another Bullet Bill mask in the air will recharge your fuel. 
Two players crashing into each other will make them both lose the masks. Crashing into anything except for sideways springs will make you lose the mask. You can place exactly seven Koopalings in your course. You can repeat some or place one of each. Larry bounces around and fires three rings at you. Giving Larry wings makes him jump much higher. Wendy fires a bouncing ring that ricochets off of surfaces and hops around. Wings make Wendy jump higher. Wendy's rings disappear after six seconds. Morton fires three rings at you and does a ground pound that stuns you and sends shockwaves across the ground. Giving Morton wings cause him to do only ground pounds. Lemmy makes bouncing balls that bounce along the ground while he balances on another ball and rolls around. Giving Lemmy wings causes him to bounce along the ground as well. Roy fires three magic rings, then burrows into the ground before popping up elsewhere. Giving Roy wings causes him to hover for a bit after he emerges from the ground. Iggy fires three rings, then moves back and forth. Giving Iggy wings causes him to hop back and forth instead. Ludwig fires three rings at different angles, then jumps up high and moves around. Giving Ludwig wings makes him hover for a while, and then he shoots two more groups of three rings. Other enemies don't take damage from the blue Mecha Koopa's laser. The red Mecha Koopa's missile explodes after five seconds and can break blocks. Lasers from the small Mecha Koopas can only break through brick blocks. Lasers from big Mecha Koopas can break through other blocks as well. The Mecha Koopa laser extends 20 blocks. Mecha Koopa lasers can't activate on-off blocks. Giving Mecha Koopa's wings makes them fly back and forth at about the same altitude they were placed. Only one Mecha Koopa at a time may be spawned from pipes, launchers, or Lakitu's. Link's shield blocks Mecha Koopa lasers. The cursed key does not send a Fanto after you if the key is discarded because there is no key door. Having multiple cursed keys does not send multiple Fantos after you. In the World Builder, power-ups are not saved between levels. You always start as a small character. You're not limited to gaining three one-ups per level in a world. Only one world per user can be uploaded. Create more than one world in the world bot. A super world cannot be uploaded unless all the courses in it are already uploaded to the course world. There are three different bonus houses to choose from. Each minigame only grants lives, not power-ups. For 50 more things that most creators don't know, click on the video on the screen right now. For more Mario Maker 2 inspiration, be sure to subscribe and click that bell. I'm Aristotle, and thanks for watching.